Shirley. Hey. My dad name is Vernon, so I be like. Selfish <laughs> ass. He wanted a junior. No, Burn my mama funny. did that being funny. Burn like you pulling out a cigarette. Hey, man. This probably brought a Virginia a Slim. Slim. <laughs> <laughs> That nigga say fur like you pull out a cigarette. Fur <laughs> like what? That old nigga say fur going over there, pat me that. <laughs> like an old person name. What you ready to call, John? Them niggas just gonna talk anyway. Oh, he called you the whole name. Burr, 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 burr. Welcome to Shot O'Clock Podcast. I am DJ Reese Boogie. Man, he was, he was in the building, baby. <laughs> Marco Polo, aka Everfresh. And Mr. I'm back. <laughs> Mr. Las Vegas. I'm here. Back. Yeah, he back, man. Guess what? We got a special guest in the house today, Miss Vernicia Allen. How you doing, Miss Vernicia? I'm fine. You know, it's hard for me to say Vernicia because I've been saying V for so long. Right. <laughs> you can but, say V. You know, it's Vernicia just sounds so long Yeah. to say Vernicia. Vernicia was on uh, Ready to Love Season what? 3. Mm -hmm. She was also on Ready to Love Time 2. New Orleans style. Huh. So I ain't saying she ain't ready to love. She just running <laughs> just around. But get what? Plan. She just ain't found the love. Plan. I'm ready. not playing. I knew. Don't start, Damien. Plan. <laughs> yeah, she called that boy Damien. Yeah, yeah, Damien. Call that boy Damien. Yeah, Damien. Yeah, Damien. 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 Well, I've been running from the feds. Go ahead, y'all. Oh, jeez. But now, man, we ain't gonna uh, jump straight into Ready to Love. I know you probably get asked those questions a lot. Mm hmm So, uh, first, you know, just tell the people, you know, where you're from a little bit about yourself. I know you got a few businesses going, and then we can get into the podcast. Okay. Um, so, I'm Vernicia Allen. I'm from originally from Galveston. Okay. Um, Texas. Been in Houston about 20 years now. Paraland, yeah. So, um... I am a 10-year salon owner. Yes, sir. Um, done hair since middle school. Always worked for myself forever. Um, retired my hair business last year. Mm -hmm. um, reality TV. I am also a, a insurance broker. Mm -hmm. So yeah, I'm very it. passionate about um, educating my people about generational wealth, mm -hmm. especially having life insurance and how important that it is. Um, and also, I'm studying for my real estate test. So. Okay. Yeah. So, let me ask you a question. Were you raised by a Jamaican? No. <laughs> Lord, you got about 20 things you just named <laughs> off the bucket list. And guess what? All of them really, besides hair, you can make money in your sleep. Right, right, right. right so, right, right. I want, that's the point I'm trying to get to, residual income. I don't want to have to trade my time for money. Oh, that's, that's pretty right. dope. I like to hear that. Yeah. And then the second thing I heard, you from Galveston. Mm -hmm. Like, what, what's in Galveston? Child, other than the dirty water, more than you think. So you grew up with the beach parties, right? Yeah, Kappa. With, with, I've been going to Kappa since I was about fourteen. Oh, sneaking. Oh, I was sneaking, oh, Mom. Oh, I'm sorry. You got a sneak. It was in the city, huh? I, I yeah, guess but it's I, still. I was. They got that one little to... strip club down in Galveston. Hold on, why you know about? I ain't know about that before you crossed the bridge. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, you know about yeah. it too? Yeah. Yeah. I always seen it, bro. It's nah, like did you ever stop? Oh, yeah, she got broke. Yeah, I never went there. But who stopped? How y'all know about that? Why ain't never? They probably been to Galveston. Yeah, never. More than definitely stopped. He definitely stopped. I ain't never been, but I see it. No, that's been there for like. I bet them dancers smell like. Seaweed. <laughs> man, yeah, that's I crazy that you even said out of everything you thought about Gal, you thought about the strip, strip club. club. I would have never thought about you strip just club. said ain't nothing else to do, so what you gonna do when you go to it's, it's a lot to do. Stop. Growing up, it was. Probably now. No, Probably I don't not. know about now. Now is nothing. Oh, now it's it lit. No, they got the spot like down there. They got the they spot down there. I like the What's spot? 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 Nah, on the beach. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> no, he's talking about the eating spot. Nah, it's called the spot. It's the it's spot. It's sitting it's on the beach. Spot. Yeah. Well, it's, it's like five restaurants in one. They know me down there. Yeah. So, uh, but no, besides eating good food. At the strip club, food, too. It ain't nothing there right now. Uh -huh. So, let me ask you a question. One more the question. Pier I'm going to leave Galveston alone. Oh, they got the pier, too. Did y'all sell parking spots during the beach party? I know everybody was making some You know bread, what? I, I don't guess. really think they did right. back right. then because that wasn't popular. Like, right. everywhere, now you got to go to park. Right, right, right. We didn't have to do so that. Y so y'all missed out on $1,000 a weekend. Out, yeah. I, that's I, it. I wish y'all knew <laughs> better back then. used to pay the people who stayed in the neighborhood. Yeah, yeah, yeah that's no, it. They still did yeah. it. They wasn't overcharging over the head. Nah, probably nah. like five But when we went, niggas like was still. Oh, we was just breaking them all. But it wasn't company. Yeah, it wasn't like that. Oh, yeah, just independent people that probably lived around there. I just thought about that because the freak nigga about to come out tomorrow on Hulu. And I know Mark was a legend at the at the Texas Beach Party. Mm. So you got any Texas Beach Party stories before we move forward? Man, I do. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> so get I was back in the day when I had my piece and chain. You okay. know what I'm saying? Doing okay. my thing. 
You know what I'm yeah. saying? Let yeah. it rain. Okay. Uh, bang, bang, bang. had bang. a Versace belt on. See, anyway, so the nigga was um, <laughs> doing the car flip. Flip, 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 Ooh. flip, flip. Doing that shit. So Some I'm money. young, about 17. Right. All my money in my pocket. Boom. I win. No, I lose. So the dude was like, well, shoot, I ain't got no more money. Yeah. He was like, well, put your piece and chain up. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Not the flea, not the flea market piece. Man, I put my piece of chain up. Man. And nigga, flip, 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 flip. Took it. Boom, I got it. Straight point shot, man. Nigga, he messed, he must have messed no, up. No, you won. I won. Oh, you won. Oh, okay. I won my money back. And, and the chain. It kept your chain. And, and oh, you got goes. Because the nigga thought he, nigga went to pick it up. Nigga yeah. flipped that thing. Nigga, I won. Oh, wow. Okay. I was yeah. crazy. I started saying, Paul, you saying that dudes, thing too much, bro. <laughs> yeah, All that. my dudes were like, nigga, you stupid. Nigga, them nigga walked off after I lost my money. Right, yeah. right. So when I put my piece of chain up, they was real, man. Yeah, you like, nigga, I need my money back. Okay. Yeah, man. Y'all, you yeah, a you crazy, old school dude. legend, boy. Yeah. Uh, hey, boy. <laughs> <laughs> that, that was just, hey, boy, they don't make a documentary. They coming for your footage, boy. <laughs> <laughs> I already know. <laughs> nah, I went, to, I went to Texas Beach Party, man. I, was, I think it probably had to be the last one because I was kind of wiggling my way out of there. I mean, I think they were trying to shut it down at that mm -hmm. time. That's when they had like a lot of police and stuff going on. It was a it was a different experience, man. You know what I'm saying? Listen. It was freaky. Nah, no, ain't never go. I don't know about freaky. No. Nah, well, she, you could come on. You could come down. Down. I ain't never go to the Texas Beach Party. I huh? went to the Cal 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 Beach Cal Cal Beach Party. Oh yeah, oh, right. yeah they switched too. it to Texas. Yeah, well, right. no, I think I was Texas when they had to. That's when Texas women had to wear clothes. Trying to shut it down. Yeah, yeah, they yeah. Had women had to wear clothes. You know, I don't recall seeing all that. No, 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 no. I was they too young. So they, mm -hmm. they shut down the Capitol Beach Party because the traffic on the bridge. The girls was naked in traffic, what and live I, and the news was catching that. That was everywhere. That's when they That's shut what I'm it saying. down. That's that was doing the Catholic change. I was like 99, 98. Well, it's definitely not the residents. So I can tell yeah. you that. No, no, no. no. That, they was definitely coming. They was coming town. to Galveston. Yeah. yeah, they yeah they shut that down yeah. because yeah, of the nudity. Yeah, I, yeah, I know, I know, Eric. I would. I know you ain't got no stories about the beach parties, man. Yeah. You definitely couldn't go down <laughs> 45. Yeah, I don't got the story about the Capitol. You know, so that's why you guys. grew up. That's why you grew up to be a good nigga, man. <laughs> <laughs> but now, nah, V, I want to get into the podcast now, man. I just wanted a quick story on on that. Let the people know a little bit about yourself. But you know, social media been taking over lately. Mm -hmm. They've been kind of having like men and women battling each other. Black and men and black women. black black men and black women. Right. And then on top of that, I guess it's a two part question. Uh, the expectations that they putting on as far as men, you know, they, they living in these false expectations. That's what I think on social media. So they putting it out there. And I think dating and all that just became a little bit weird yeah. and hard. So what's your what's your outlook on, on social media? And... Hmm. I wish it didn't exist. I can tell you that much. Um, but, I mean, it's good monetary. Right. You know, for people to make money. But people do have, like, fake personas of what relationships, real relationships are. Like the eating. Correct. The so do you think that women's standards have been changed and, and they didn't let social media influence them to not get good dudes no more? Not that your standards is superficial. Um, I think some women's standards aren't high enough. And then some mm. women's standards are entirely too high for what they have to offer. So it depends on who we're talking about. Do, does social media have an effect on Absolutely. that? Absolutely. Yeah, because, because we, we look at these word. fake relationships. People only post the good things. Nobody's posting bad. Mm. You know what they're going through behind closed doors. How many of these <laughs> fantasies, uh, relationships that people see, and then it come out that the dude was beating the woman right, or right, cheating right, on her. Right, or right. Or the woman her. beating the man. Uh, hey, or she's cheating or something like that. I Whatever that it is. I say that because I saw the court case today where the woman... <laughs> <laughs> where, where, where the man case. filed for divorce, mm -hmm. and the girl showed up at the courthouse with the camera. Oh yeah, y'all ain't see that? Yes, nah, sir. I ain't see that. One. I yeah, see that. fat face chick. Yeah, yeah. And she, she looked like she bite. She bite too. Yeah, she, she looked like she, she beat. Like she, yeah, she, she, that nigga, she, bite. she, she like, like she bites like a whole. Chill. She said, "Let's get out of here. Don't make me act up." She mm -hmm. got on live. Why she recording it like that? Then? She, was, she already she didn't know she was finna. Get crazy till he didn't get up when she got there. Ooh. Yeah, she was then in court. Then when he started talking, she was right. like, nigga, what are you talking about? Let's go. Yeah, he was, hey, you, you ain't got to whisper to me. Oh, okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. We, ain't no, we, yeah, she ain't, was, we ain't at court, my boy. Yeah, she was down, he was nah, down there. but I said that because, like, but that's like a real relationship. Oh, is, yeah. Where people don't show. People show the other side, the, they show the glitz and the glamour. You know, the right. glorious. Well, I'm talking about as far as, too, 
like the, the the restaurants, you know, like they put the restaurant thing out there. You know, what you think about that? Was that like mm. a reality thing, or you got? I know you got your standards too. So well, I don't eat Cheesecake Factory not because it's a low standard. You can take me to get some chicken or something in the hood okay. rather than taking. But me not to on chicken. the first date. I mean, I don't eat there, so I wouldn't. I don't take my kids there. I just don't go there. Right, right. So right. I would have just said, "Nah, we can go and do something else." Or it could have been equivalent to it, you know, price-wise. It don't always have to be like a steakhouse or nothing like that. But you are required to date me, and mm -hmm. I date myself. <laughs> right. So I take myself on nice dates. So uh, she's gay, pretty expensive, bro. Well, I hey, remember. I've been there. It's been. <laughs> I just don't. Like I don't it. know. It ain't that expensive, though, boy. No, nah, it, <laughs> nah, it ain't. It ain't, no, no, bro. I don't know what your tab is, like. Yo. <laughs> I know, you, I know you married. He, he like probably, meal. He ordering the whole bro, cake. Bro, bro, that ain't, slice. bro, bro. Them meals are like twenty two dollars a plate, bro. What? You, but I remember bro, back in the day, size, bro. What I remember you, you used to you, have, you used to have to wait to get a seat <laughs> to go like, into the cheesecake factory. I'd rather go to Yo, Grand Lux. Cheesecake Lux's. factory was him. Right, 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 right. Grand Lux, my spot. I go too, to Grand Lux. I go to cheesecake. But do you think uh, social media in between is it? Is it? hurting the community as far absolutely, as black people absolutely i feel like it, it's, it's these platforms and you know it's, we got the podcast too and then we try not and to and it's a lot of the podcast no it's a lot it's a lot <laughs> these men i'd be like jesus but i think some people write down they they material before they get there and they trying to do well, clickbait right and, and and the women are giving us a lot of well they give y'all a lot to talk about a lot yeah, yeah. a lot to eat Hold on. Right. And, and, and Dodgers. You've been on a lot. He and Dodgers, man. Hold on. Was it your cup? Nigga. <laughs> <laughs> no, but. But you said, nigga, you take some of this shit off your plate. What they, what they Yo, giving you to eat, dude? They making it easy. Right. With all the Cheesecake Factory. The, uh, the lunch thing, why well, I, I seen you yeah, $35 for lunch. Yeah, $30 a day. Hey, I would have took it. I, I ain't seen nothing. You bring all your oh, yeah, home yeah, yeah, yeah. girls right. to the table and want me to pay for I don't think so, not people. my man. You know what I'm saying? Well, so they, my they, mentality they, different, because I right. want my dude paying for all my friends. But like, see, it's my yeah. birthday. Now, but see, we, we not, plan, we're not hearing y'all, though. Right. Exactly. But we ain't loud we, we, because we we moving like that. We ain't talking about it. The world start putting the bad stuff out. No, that's what I think, y'all. I think it's a lot. Like I say, I think it's a lot of clickbait. I don't be thinking some of them stories even real. I it's, just think they know they're going to go viral. Not. It's not, bro. If they put them out there. Uh, like, you had the one chick in the grocery store. The man was trying to talk to her. Mm -hmm. And she told the nigga, asked the nigga, are you buying my groceries? To you know what I'm saying? Yeah, just to get my number. To like, it's just a lot yeah. of weird and shit. People, you know how many people have met in a grocery store and, like, got married? Right, and fell in love. Like, right. Yeah, like... So why the dude got to buh your groceries? Right. I don't right. know. H-E-B kind of like the capital. That's kind of... Hey, I love... H-E-B hey. on the phone. Hey, 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 nigga, nigga, wake up, go to H-E-B. Yo, you got to put some on. Like, why you right. got to put shades yeah. on? Yeah, you got to put shades on, my boy. Yo, I'm into the white location. I'm going to eat and get the drinks. No, no, no. What I found out right now from you is... Yo, yo, chick trying to go to the grocery store. You like, nah, baby, I'll I go take this. care of that. Yeah, yeah. Oh, like, I go to the grocery store. <laughs> yeah. Hey, I am the grocery store. Bro, right I just made a post about, man, y'all talking about this talking, this talking is like going to a Catholic church. H-E-B is my spot. Yeah. H-E-B is my spot. On a Saturday. Oh, yeah. And I say, meet me, yeah. me on all nine. Right. So I'm posted. So who y'all got? Y'all got H-E-B or Wally World? I'm H-E-B. Oh, no, Wild so, World, them hoes different. Wait, so I that's... love Wild World, I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> I, I, Just to, like, run in there during the week, but, like, weekends, I like H-E-B. Yeah. Wild, Wild World ain't offering you no wine. No, Right. And no free uh, samples, food. It's yeah, you can get full right, at, right, you right, get full right, right. at H&B, full. just Walmart, turn your hat backwards. Walmart, you're going to see the slides in the bonnets. Yeah. And we, really be we're out, not trying to do really that at the grocery stores. Eating. Yeah, yeah. I, I go to, gro I go to h and twice a week because I like the water. So I run through the water <laughs> a lot. They be like, why you don't just buy two cases? I be like, no, nah, because I'm going to drink both so of the cases. Bought, that's lazy, bro. Just get the other cases. He want to go there and see the He want to be able to go. He trying to go. He's trying to go. Oh, you want to go keep looking, too? No, well, that's the club. Y'all niggas are the college. I'm all nine posts. Y'all should call each other. This one right here. Hey, what hey, is it, McGregor? Hey, meet me on all night. I don't go to that one. I don't I go, go to that my, one. I have a daughter at TSU, so I go there. I go to I go to Washington. Meet me on all night. <laughs> I'll be posting on all that's night wild. like I'm hustling. <laughs> I swear to God, but that's where sparkling water at. I feel all night just post it. Right. Yeah. Oh, act like you're on your phone. Real retarded. Waiting until walk by. Real retarded. Now, that's crazy. <laughs> I love H-E-B. Hey, but V, I got one more. Uh, we need sponsors. This is definitely off topic uh, from the conversation we have, but it's been a lot going on in social media with the uh, older 
Instagram models, older, you know, women that's been mm -hmm. messing with these younger ball players and getting pregnant. So I just mm -hmm. wanted, because we talked about it a little bit last episode, mm -hmm. but we didn't have a woman perspective on it. You know, what is your outlook on it? Because, you know, I can give you my... Just it couldn't be your son. No, yeah. I have a 22-year-old daughter. I couldn't oh, wow. imagine. She is very much still codependent on me. Right. And she she works. She makes great money. Mm -hmm. Right. And so everybody, like, oh, they got their different tech. You know how many young? I'm 43. Right. So I attract a lot of young. I look young. Right. But uh, even 30 somethings, I'd be so like, So, what are you no. dating? What's, your, what's the youngest you're I, dating? I dated a guy like four years younger than me, but that was like. That was a lot. Eight years ago. And oh, it was mm. a lot mentally. So, I don't date young guys. Okay. I okay. honestly don't. But if you if you ran into a, a Jalen Green $300 million. Into a mile. You run to mm. a mile? Yeah, to mm. be very honest. Uh -huh. and it's a Pop your shit there, V. Yeah. <laughs> Big V, not, not the little one. <laughs> right. But young, what you talking uh, about? Yeah. Yeah. I know so, I see you sitting court side you before. I mean, hey. <laughs> yeah. But, um, no, no. Young, absolutely not. That's the first thing I was like, how old are you? Because they got them baby faces. And I'm instantly, like, turned off. Yeah, I think. I can't uh, take care of my babies. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I got kids your age. Right. So. And then there are more women. That's always been in in uh, social well, that's media, right? Lifestyle. How about right. say it's a lifestyle? So I think it's a different. One. I think it was their first time getting pregnant or their first time, you know, coming out. You kind of ah, you know, this mm -hmm. and that. But when they've been in the industry and they've been mm -hmm. with multiple guys, you know, what I'm saying yeah, they, they kind of just have look. a motive. I, and I, so I'm on the fence of it with Joy. So I have parents. My mom is nine years older than my stepdad. So you about to get Joy a pass? I just want to know, cause Joy. I'm gonna tell you why though. Okay. Mm -hmm. So, but my parents been together thirty years. Joy get a pass from everybody though. I ain't gonna lie. So your mama nine years older than your pops? Yeah, my stepdad. Okay. He been thirty years since I was eleven years old. Okay. 30 okay. Mama started this. Okay, keep going. Let's <laughs> <Right. laughs> see. No, but he was very much an adult, and she was too. But my stepdad, like I don't know, I can, the maturity level, like he was very mature. I was 11, like I wouldn't have never known that they had an age difference until mm -hmm. I was old enough to right. really understand. Right. Mm -hmm. Like, and still to this day, a right. one top of the line. Well, well Jalen Green, he wear well, black painted fingernail. He pretty well, mature. Green, nah, it be my different thing, colors that's a too. Ain't only year, black. That's almost a 20 year difference. Right. That's different between think. my parents being nine years and 17 years. So would you date a man who wore uh, black painted Absolutely fingernail? Absolutely not. I would date a man today that wear a finger. I'm glad I took mine off. Oh, D Mo. I don't no, that's not my thing. I ain't gonna say Joy get a pass, but I can see more of a Joy cold though. Similarity. Like even with just conversation, that can have more of a of mutual conversations than Dre. Dre's forty. Yeah, she's right. right. Boy, sure. She has her a, son, twenty, right? A yeah, child yeah. Same same age. Age. yeah. Yeah. As yeah. him, that's a totally she, different Bern, scenario. Bernie's right. forty-two. And, she like young guys. And, and, she says it very open. She Jaylen got people Brown, that's her, 25, her daughter. 25. Her daughter like twenty-two. Yeah. Something like that. Well, I must yeah. say, her daughter I, I, I really she cold disagree. too. Oh, she cold. Go ahead, bro. With the whole concept, I feel like if you're twenty-one and up, you should be able to date whoever you want. Whether your mama, daddy agree with it. Whether the society agree with it, um, love is love him, is love. I blame no, her. No, 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 nobody's nobody's no, no, saying no, wait, wait, nobody's wait. in the wrong. No. Can't date. I'm saying, but she, people really talking about her. She has an but ulterior motive. If she this, was sixty, <laughs> it's the motive behind yeah, it. Hold on, on, let's let's see where you're getting so with this, y'all. So if she was sixty, and he was forty-one. Would it be a problem? Yeah, because his brain is a little bit more mature. Mm -hmm. He kind of yeah. went through more right. life It'll experiences. Totally he right. kind of, you know, he yeah. kind of went through it's life different. a little bit. Like right now, look at the industry. Twenty-two, the he'll, ball, he'll the see ball ball player. When yeah. I was twenty-two, I used to love older women. They all do. Right. What if he was a construction worker? How many of them you got pregnant? Mature. How many of them you got pregnant? I don't, <laughs> <laughs> say, I don't know. Exactly. So this is my thing. This is my thing about. I'm a guy who I'm talking to. Go ahead, so This is my thing about Bernie's and Drea. Let's just be honest. They they fire was burning out. <laughs> so let's. It's time for me to get hot again. Let right, me right, let right, me right. let me figure out a way. You got Jalen Brown, the richest man in the NBA. He right. dated Bernice too. Yeah, that's who he's with now, currently. Yeah, that's yeah. Jalen Brown. So he's not he, with Drea. No, 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 no. no that's oh, Jalen oh, Green. That's Jalen Green. Jalen Green from the yeah, Rock. It's two Jalen. It's Jalen Green, Jalen Brown. Yeah, so Jalen Brown. Brown. He's the, he's the big. He got the biggest. Both got color names. Green. And what? <laughs> what? Jalen Green 
Jalen Brown. That, yeah. Hey, why is that different when like he got the turtleneck on? Yeah. This nigga acting really different with the turtleneck. I ain't gonna lie. Somebody that's more yeah. of on a maturity level. And they are around, surrounded by men with money. Right, that's what it yeah. is. So why, have, why date the kids with money? Why not date the... Yeah, they got the older, older niggas. They got why older not date the age and the coach? They got older oh. niggas with money. Yeah. I'm, I'm going to tell you why. They ain't money. got that emotion. It's they ain't got that emotion, bro. They know they can play on them. No, yeah, older you know, men ain't going for it. Jalen nah, Green yeah. just... Yeah. He's, he's up for a contract. Jalen Brown just got a contract. Yeah. Make it make sense. That, it, look at the common denominator. The money. And, I, and that's the problem, the motive. The motive. And they, yeah. they know it's the better. agenda. I'm talking yeah. that shit, though, but I had, like, crushes on, on older women when I was coming of course. up. And if I would have got that bag early... I probably would have been Jaden Green. I would have pulled that. But they already got their money, though. You know what I would have told myself? Yeah, I would have pulled that. Right, right, If you got a crush on her, that's fine, baby. Go ahead and do your thing, because she going to let you. I would have pulled that. But don't get stuck. But we talk about motive. They already already got their bag, though. Is it really that a motive like that? Who got their bag? Bernice got a bag. They got their bag. But Dre is probably... probably But let me tell you, they ain't got their bags. They don't have no They got their bags. Yeah. Like that's a different type and of money. And it's child, never... that, that child support here different when it's yeah, like, she need this. another when she it's zero behind. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, she been get another eighteen years. Hey, listen, so she y'all. gonna be fifty eight. She, she preparing for the retirement. When she, re- when she okay. ready to. I mean, it's just gonna be my son. Hey, right. But it, I, retirement it, baby. It's gonna roll into my next one then, because we still in twenty twenty four, right? Mm-hmm. And with that, with that, we talk about social media still. We talking about them dating older uh, women. Mm-hmm. So what's more popular now? You think uh, being a baby mama or a wife in 2024? It's being a baby mama, but it's really unfortunate because it should be a wife. It's so, it, like, I'm going to tell you this story. I went to uh, Tulum, like, last year, year four last. Okay. And I was just doing, like, my you got own flown survey. Out? Oh, no, I oh. flew. That was a girl. <laughs> <laughs> that was a good I mean, question. Good question. The, the <laughs> no, it's a good flow. question. Good no, question. I yeah. am good past question. those things. No, you're not because no, it's... You, what? I, I mean, you're you probably no mature enough well, wise. I got to be dating you. Uh, okay. Like a random dude uh, can't uh, African, just, uh, yeah. African can't, can't grab you and nah, say, let me fly no. you. Right, okay. Because them niggas don't give a shit. They You want to see my DMs? Them niggas don't even want to be there. They just want to fly. I don't... I'm not doing it because I know what comes with it. The bug will try to... No. All right, go ahead. Finish your stuff. I'm just saying, I was like just looking at like uh the women of color fingers versus the non-colored hmm. women talk about and majority talk, of them were married it. and hmm. we were not and i brought it to one of my girlfriend's attentions i was and it made me kind of sad i was like damn what are we doing right like why are we're why are we not getting married mm-hmm. you know what i'm saying and, mm-hmm. and i was a young baby mama right you know like i was becoming a product of my environment so right. i had kids out of way like i did that and if I knew better, I would have did better. Mm-hmm. Did so I teach my kids and I teach people around me and my mentors ship and like right. you have to teach girls, you know, to just want more. Yeah, to learn from your mistakes. Yeah. Pretty much All learn from your mistakes. Is- Who's y'all? Who's don't y'all? put that on my car. Why you don't know I like that? Hold on, bro. V, I ain't even love what? shit. No. Don't do that. I'll pick a pop, grab no, a cue ball. No, let me, let me rewind. <laughs> yeah, go no, she asked a question. Okay. What is wrong with what us? What are we doing wrong? What are we right. doing wrong? We. We. Oh, so okay. she said y'all. Oh, so he going to go school on us. He going to go to school on us. But it ain't just the women, though. It's the man, too. I'm going to say all in 20. Y'all just want a section with some hookahs. Huh? Wait and some bottles pop. I'm they just being them, honest. You know, and <laughs> if you scroll through your social media, right. yeah. you're going to see people out. Bitch, we're outside I looked tonight. At this today. It, it made me mad. Mm-hmm. As black people and how we are now. Our mentality. Our mentality is, is messed up right now. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. All we want is a section, a bottle. We want cheap drinks when we go out. If the Jeep, if the drinks are cheap, if the hookah's cheap, the freaks are cheap. We having a great time, and we putting this on social media. Yeah. Hey right. y'all, I just went to such and such. Boom, this was this, this was that, and that's all we. And we like, okay, I'm going. Yeah. When you look My- at. The, 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 hey, brother, the quit China pointing your means. hands and be so aggressive. Asian, Asian. Go keep it Asian. Let's keep it let's, let's, let's do it even better. But right. look at the upper echelon tax bracket black mm-hmm. people. Okay. They're not posting where they go, yeah. what they smoke, what hookah right, flavor right. they like, um, the crowd they are. 
they taking care of business behind mm-hmm. closed doors I ain't gonna lie to you, and bro. doing pop ups. You got. I, ju- I just told you gotta, myself, y'all that, gotta stop. Look, I, no, I just Go told ahead, myself that the other day. I was like, man, I, I need to follow other people, bro, because that's all that's, I see on my timeline. I'm time about line. to say that, but I need to follow you, different people. You was following Diddy before he got jabbed up, and Diddy is that yeah. nigga was outside. Take that, take that. I'm just saying how our mentality right, is. Right. But it, I'm, I'm talking about today. I saw this, mm-hmm. and it, it just made me. But that's start who you thinking. follow, though. That's I, but I don't want. Well, it's it's the parents allow on social media to, to raise their kids too. Yeah, but I I just don't want to be in that. Let's, number let's no touch more. a little bit more on that. Let me hear a little bit about that. They are. Kids are only following and doing, and young adults, what they see on social media. Nobody's teaching them yeah. the right and wrong way. We as parents, you can't get mad. If this is what you allow your kids right. to, and and right. I ain't, my kids on social media, but they know better. Yeah. I ain't worried about my kids going off with no predators, following this, doing that because I talk to them, because I'm a I'm a parent that, right. that understand and I know better. Yeah, social so, media has become the blueprint. Yeah. So everybody's monkey see monkey do. Yes. Oh, let me try to get to this point. Not knowing what this person done went through. Yes. What <laughs> the the you no know, the, the bullet points yeah. that they follow it's. Oh, they throwing money, they shaking ass, they doing this, and they got a million followers. followers yep. Let right. me do exactly what I see on here. I ain't going to lie oh, to yeah. When you follow somebody that got all them followers, you be trying to figure out how the fuck they got them <laughs> no You be like, man, let me follow the blueprint. What you doing, brother? So that's just right. people that's in the world that's trying. Everybody want to be a content well, creator. What they Right. Everybody want to be a content sales. creator. So if you yeah, find so and do. you showing your butt, right. you right. are going to have You're going to get the follow. Sexy Here's Red the got it on lock, huh? Thing. Speaking of, <laughs> bow, all bow, the black bow. people want to be content creators. Why you keep saying that? Why you got to get black people, man? Go look at it. Why are you stopping your feet? My other algorithm. Nah, when I look at Amazon. Nah, look. When I look at Amazon. Nah, listen. When I look at Amazon, when I look at DIY projects, it's white folks. When I look at going to restaurants, it's different It's different ethnicities. So, now they content creators too, though, my boy. Let him get it off his chest, y'all. He's passionate right now. They got what they got. Right. I'm talking about our culture right. right now okay was making everybody rich all the other coaches and everybody we doing it i'm mm-hmm. saying like he said when we look at oh this nigga got a million fr- what he doing nigga i want to be like phil you know what i'm saying yeah okay. yeah come on free <laughs> why you have to admit you i'm nervous yeah. all over yeah. again <laughs> what? When you say Shout I, talk, when I talked about I talked about the upper echelon black okay. people. Yeah. They not posting. They not trying to get a million followers. Nah. They not trying to they just doing what they do behind scene, making money and looking at us trying well, to be. I think right. first off, that's kinda hard with what you with where you go in that direction. Cause I think social media is supposed to be for the younger folks, right? Correct. But social media has painted this almost unreachable picture to the young yeah. people. Unrealistic right. picture. It's lost, very unrealistic. To raise us. Right. And, nigga, we not even concerned about how we going to go get the bag anywhere else because we then seen all these yeah. people with a million followers. We want it. Right. Hey, man, you, you let me tell you something. You very passionate. That's your algorithm, nigga. And I nigga. like that, man. I like that you <laughs> passionate about this topic, nigga. man. I like that no, turning in Marco. Know, I don't know what happened. I don't. No, but I see. What, I, I, no, I, I agree hold with Debo. I don't know what happened in your life <laughs> or what transpired since the last episode. Because I know we didn't talk yeah. about this several times. You want this passionate? Maybe it's V. <laughs> maybe he got you passionate tonight, or maybe it's the turn nigga like hot. That right turn there. Hey, man, you it's definitely in your bag it's right six now. Six five degrees in Houston, man. It's That's not cold. Worthy. That's <laughs> job. It's, okay, it's boy. perfect. Job. And, and yeah. it's thin. It's perfect in uh, Y'all Chicago keep playing with my shirt. Nah, wearing, nah, you good. Other people wearing shorts, but are we? No, we like. Yeah, AKA Shaw Slee. We like it. Jesus. I keep looking at it. Hey, that's cool. We can put hey, 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 we, 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 we know, we know what your head. turn is. Fashion don't have no boundaries, my boy. Dog. Don't have Just no boundaries. Just no shorts. <laughs> About, I wish you had the short term with the two. Oh, not on that screen, we would have went viral. <laughs> what the hell was the Wheatley shorts? <laughs> hey, then you turn that with the short term, we went viral. Is it turn that cool for the night? It's fine. All right, okay, well, we're going to move forward. She tried to be a Christian. So you pulled up on the first date. Ask me. B, if you pulled up on the first date with. with hey, he sees it. I know he sees it. But it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yes, sir, Unc. Yes, sir, Unc. Get it up. Yes, sir, Unc. 
Yeah, because she ain't messing with no kids. She so I, bro, you got it. She finally you stepped on the like, show, man. That nigga season. That nigga misses dash. That shit ain't got slap, no flavor. Slap your mama season. Okay, my boy. <laughs> All right, man. Let's move on, man. Let's get off Unk, man. Where you going, my boy? Oh, he, he, purse. he did LeBron James. Like yeah. <laughs> LeBron, I like them pants, though. He bro. grabbed his purse hey, like hey, LeBron. Hey, let's move on, man. Let's yeah. get off Unk, man. Give him a little breather, man. Okay. You need a drink? Nah, I'm good. He, nah, he don't need nothing else to drink. Hey, uh, what benefits can a man or a woman get from marriage that Ooh. they can't get from an outside, you know, from an outside relationship? Because I know a lot of people be chasing, um, mm -hmm. you know, chasing the, the the side chick and doing all that. But why 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 should people why get married? Yeah, why get married? When well, what's the benefits of, of it? For God, so that's me first mm -hmm. and foremost. Right. That is something that uh, we it's what God wants for us. So why don't we want it no more for each other? Everybody like, oh, we don't got to get married. It's a piece of paper. It's not just a piece of paper. So it's a business. A lot of people say it's a business yeah. now. Well, that's yeah. people that's in it for business reasons. Right, right. <laughs> um, I want to get married for love, like actually be in love. Ready for like, love. Ready. <laughs> ah, yeah. Ready for love. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ah, <laughs> you ain't know we did that. We tried to do it. We ain't know we did that. We, we, yeah, yeah, yeah. we, we so had practice. We had practice. <laughs> No, we watched I mean, I've been watch. that shit last night. We fans. <laughs> yeah, so, I, I, I feel like I actually thought about why didn't God let us smash a bunch? Why why didn't he condone that? You mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? Because I thought about it. Yeah. Listen to me, folks. No, I good. always think Hold about on, the man. covenant. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Because that's what he says. It's better to marry than to burn. That's what he say. And I was like, well, dang, I'd rather get married than to burn. That's just being honest. Mm -hmm. But at the same time, I was like, dang, God, why you ain't just, you know what I'm saying, let us do our thing? I don't, I don't know. I can't answer that question. But the covenant is a great reason to be your first Absolutely. reason to want to get married. That's definitely mine. And some of the, um, what did you ask? <laughs> the uh, good stuff about it is. Yeah, that, that's the question. One is the covenant. Right. You know, you, you, you linked up with the man up above. And just, nigga, the comfort, the coming home, the this. Having your person. You ain't having your person. <laughs> you ain't got to go searching every night. I used to be in the club every night. Right. Oh, you ain't got to say it like that at me. <laughs> <laughs> nigga, I, I ain't I ain't Demo, I know you had something to say. What you got? Uh, you said why God didn't allow us to smash. Mm -hmm. uh, is it safe to say that David was one of his favorite children? Child. Children. Child. Amen. Kids. Amen. Hey Amen. How many how many wives David had? A lot. Okay then. Move on. Oh, so you say so oh. you saying it's okay to have a whole bunch of wives. Well, so uh, you're not a, you're not, you're not hey man. Man. Oh man. I, I, we I, ain't well, do that I mean, right I here. feel like when, if that's something I, that all parties are in agreement with mm -hmm. and they all married and they allowing this one man to have all these wives. So I uh I get a question all the time because I'm really I'm I'm I study. I I'm heavy. You was bachelor book. of the year last year too. Let's put that out there. Let's so. stop, man. We're not, Boy, there you go hating. There you go. There you go. Nah, he was on. He was You heard it. You heard it two week, two episodes ago. Episode thirty nine. You heard he was it. Lying. No, he, he wasn't lying. I won that. I took that. You want? I'm gonna bring the trophy next. <laughs> <laughs> right, right. No, but um. Who I was get, all can that man finish? <laughs> man, cause somebody subbed this nigga out, man. Man, you just mad. You ain't out there no more, bro. Let the man shut. No, I. I <laughs> I Not get I get the question a lot. Uh, I know who else was in. Hold on, my fault. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> it, it was him, Killer Callio, and Slim Thug, and somebody else, bro. I don't remember. Nah, that Slim thing. ain't no bachelor. Slim really got a gal. Y'all don't let that ah, don't, don't, don't do Slim like that. Public. Well, go ahead, finish your statement. My bad. I that, just want to put a few names. Them every time they out of the country. <laughs> nah, let, let's hear the research. Nah. Let's hear the research. No, 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 no. So I get a lot of people. They come to me about biblical questions. Like, right. so somebody asks me, is it a sin to have multiple wives? Polygamy a sin? I say, the Bible says you are to be obedient to the law of the land. If That's the law permits multiple wives, how is it a sin? It's not a sin. That's He's, what it says. It's, it's plain and simple. Own. But in here, it's plain and, and simple. And you're not in here, nigga? Right. No, not yeah. in Utah. Not in Utah. Yeah, you talk. Hold on, first off, Mucho. You talk got a lot of documentaries that's been jumping out of there about a lot of them dudes going That's to only jail. because they can't control it. It's like weed. 
It's just like we. Yeah. They, it's only coming out because they, they, they can't they control They taking over the whole Utah's house. like Texas. Got their own rule. Yeah, they be having. Yeah. Yeah, they be wilding. I sold Texas, credit, I sold credit wife, cards. You're going to jail. I sold credit cards <laughs> for two years, and I couldn't touch Utah. Them niggas got their own banks. They were just like we Black Wall Street was in Oklahoma. They had their own shit. You don't touch Utah. The Mormons don't play that shit. Don't so, man. Don't. So Demo, you say you sold credit cards? Yeah, I sold credit cards. Now with, with that, with that on <laughs> your head, you look like a nigga that sold some credit cards. God damn. <laughs> Lil Ali, Lil um, smell like so, that. So, but I, before you go, Woods, yeah. maybe you can re, re, restart this conversation. Bring it back. Cause yeah, the, yeah. the the initial question was, what was the benefits? You know, I know you are a man that's about to walk down the aisle in 2024. So, you know, being that you was a bachelor of the year at one point in time in your yeah, life, I had it. I, what um, benefits are you getting from, from you know, the adjustment that you made? No, nah, I just I just see the, the kind of like what Mark was talking about and and V was talking about as far as just peace. You know, you know you're going to have that, that confidence and you know God going to have your back when you're doing it right. Favorite. You know, um... Uh, just, just, just that, 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 that peace and that, that stability and that wanting to grow with somebody. It's easy to go outside and, 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 and find somebody, but to connect with somebody, that shit hard. So mm -hmm. when you find somebody you're willing to marry, right. mm -hmm. you got to cherish that shit. And that's just, and, and that, and that moment right there and that, and, and that is just what you want to, what you want to hey, chime you know, in on. You know bro. why I brought it back to you? Yeah. You're a well-spoken man. <laughs> you. Talk about it. <laughs> Christian Deacon Elder, <laughs> that man. you never answered the question. Yeah. Other, I did. After you I gave did. a sermon, just answer the question next time, <laughs> preacher. It was what he said. V, you good on that? As you all right? Hey. Yeah. Uh, uh, what y'all beefing? A healthy marriage. Hey, 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 healthy man. We really promote healthy beefing. marriage, bro. It's Demo beautiful, y'all. Feel like you can be out here popping everything, moving still. It depends and on your still, region. So I respect the region. I've been married. I've been. I've done I know that. that. But yeah. I'm like, again. Uh uh. uh You're no. not getting married. Okay. No. Well, it, no. It doesn't benefit a man. Okay. So that's no. what the question is. Okay. No, it, so it doesn't benefit the man. So let's speak on that. That's what we want to speak that's on. That's not true. No. Talk about it, it. It doesn't benefit the man. No, we ain't got to go. Respond. Matter of fact, no, you might not want to go into your question. I don't, I don't. No, no. I don't want to. I don't. Yeah, we ain't got to. We ain't got to. It just doesn't benefit the man at all. Right. But he's saying that. But he don't want to get to his personal life. You know. I didn't ask him about his personal life. So you think from a standpoint of divorce. Well, right. I'm speaking of a, of a standpoint of overall open. because we're, you know, we're we're expected to do so much. And then, you know, especially, well, I know we're going to get into the next. Uh, no, you good, brother. I want you, uh, time whole, you got the hat on, you, how you split, you <laughs> how you splitting bills and all this here and the man. Is, we, we on some, no, no, our grandparents, they, they bills was $600. And Papa still made $1,200 every two weeks. Yeah, yeah, so y'all try to compare then to now uh, when inflation is going right. crazy. And, it's like, and Debo might be not coming from a place like I said, healthy marriage. So healthy right. marriage, I feel like you're gonna benefit mentally, you're gonna benefit physically, you're right. gonna be motivated, right. spiritually and motivated. Yeah, you're gonna, yeah. you gonna, you gonna I see benefits, bro. Absolutely, right. I, I see the benefits. Money. Right, right. All right, well, boom. I appreciate y'all, man. Again, I appreciate y'all helping me out. <laughs> hey, Carly B, just uh. Who? Carly B. Car Cardi, 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 Cardi B. Cardi B. <laughs> hey, man, that's the Keela kick in sometimes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, man, cut that out. Let's start over. Hey, Cardi B, uh, she want, recently just came out and said something about she believed that uh, marriage, you know, a healthy relationship, they should B, still go 50 50. Uh, because, especially like, she wasn't even talking about rich folks. She was talking about people that's trying to build and trying to grow. She was trying to say, one of her statements was if your husband is paying all the bills, he don't have room to save. He don't have room to do nothing else because all you want him to do is work and pay the bill because that's right. what everybody's saying a man that's should do. You know, your spouse should do as a man, but he can't take you on a trip. He can't take you out to eat. He can't do nothing else because his job, everybody don't make six figures. Everybody don't right. make, you know, a lot of money. So, but you have found somebody you're in love with, right. but you still trying to say, you know, you got to pay the bill because that's what a man should do. Mm -hmm. You know, so you put him in a tight spot. So I just want to get, I can go with you, Vika. You the guest. You know, what you what you got on the 50-50? So I have a few perspectives on that. My okay. first one being, um, Damien talking about back in the days when Ooh. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna know, talk about that. Yeah, we're gonna talk too. about that. How we the, can. The, we sure the can. fathers we and sure can. fathers, they ran, you know, they held the households down. But they also Grandma dealt with cheating, infidelity outside. <laughs> no, no, v, you say you're going to go on. No, hold on, Zemo. She said she's going to get on that later. Let's talk about it. All of that. Like, listen, because 
we lived through it. We were the grandkids. Like we 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 seen a lot of stuff growing up. Mm-hmm. Okay, but to the fifty fifty. Right. I don't necessarily believe in fifty fifty, but this is how me I feel like my household right. has gone, and I would like it continue to go. I feel like the man should keep a roof over his family head, if nothing else. Right. I don't want to split the mortgage. I don't want to split the rent. Now I would pay all the bills. Besides that, I'll pay the light, water, gas, bring the groceries, okay. and take care of the kids because that's what I do. That's 50 50. That's 50 50. It, it, it pretty okay, much well, is. If that's considered mm-hmm. 50 50, that's fine. 50. I'm just not splitting mortgage. Right. Yeah, that's 50 50. Yeah. But that's it. But I will definitely help and pull my weight. Shit, that, right. that will still give me some leverage because I'm doing it all by myself right now. So. I yeah. swear to God, yeah. I swear. If you come in and take up my mortgage, yeah, then I, listen. I, 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 yeah. I, I definitely think that's all 50 50. I right think now. that. That's why we go. I know we've been on social media a lot. I guess I might call this topic shit social media influence. Right. <laughs> but social media, I think the way a lot of clips and stuff have been coming out, they kind of been throwing like a lot of women out. They think, mm-hmm. I think the perspective like of a real relationship and building and growing with somebody, a nigga, they want a nigga to come in from day one and pay their rent before they even go out to eat sometimes. They be like, this nigga. I think ain't, that's damn. people that's not surrounded by like healthy. Love healthy right. black marriages. I like mm-hmm. how you pointed at wood. So many because he said that not too mm-hmm. long ago. But I'm surrounded by it. Yeah. My parents been together 30 years. My my right. dad, my Ooh. real dad. I have two dads, so I ain't raised off of. Uh, oh, your mom was a player. No, I have. My dad oh, been in my t- life. <laughs> my whole life and my stepdad been there the last 30 plus years. So I've always been. I was raised on love. Right, 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 right. Not a around me. Right. So you can't come in and feed me and no. Give me no anything right. and bullshit me, and but that do be the be the problem. Like y'all saying, women want people, men just to come in and do this. That I think it's just story. the expectations that throw. But these a lot men of stuff really want to come in and do nothing. Uh oh, oh that's bomb. See, that's, 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 that's a bomb. And I'm not even the talking bomb. about paying right. that's, that's a bomb. They don't even no, not even a bomb. Like, they yeah. don't even they, they and it's not even that. I don't even date bombs. That's good. I'm dating men. But a lot of women, a lot of women sleeping with bombs though, and then they get on. These men don't know how to plan dates. Like right. literally, it's it's and these forty plus year old men. It's yeah, bad. yeah. A lot of them baby daddies it, it is some bombs. bombs. Out there. They playing right. Madden during business hour, but Man, you expect this. me to? Wait a minute, I know your baby daddy. Why you ain't give him? No, you ain't had no expectations for him. Well, it's personal. Experience. Why you got? Yeah, it's personal. <laughs> nah, it ain't personal. No, 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 no. Nah, it ain't personal. What's personal to me is why you ready to marry me, but you been a hoe for the last twenty years. Right. I want some of that hoe too. <laughs> but we got. <laughs> we, we, hey, we what we as healthy. About? Look, we as healthy. I we, not. We, we as healthy people. We got to stop giving the time to the bones. Absolutely. Though. Yeah, we I do. We still agree. Women, yeah. men, we I still like sleeping like with that. the bones, and we giving like them that. the motion, and they can they they getting on social media and they saying all this bullshit. And you want to talk about? Come over, I'm a cook. No, I'm not right, coming. Right. My thing is, I'm 40. I don't put myself in certain situations that I know I don't want right. to be in. I'm not okay. coming over to your house. I don't want you cooking for me. I cook. We gonna pray several times a week. We ain't gonna. We ain't gonna do none of that. <laughs> you said pray or so play. So he can't invite you over. Nah, and he cook. Uh, un- un- Absolutely not the first day. <laughs> no, not the first day. Okay. Thank you for this food. Right, right. right. I feel like your mind is so, even We're if not you don't have to your motive, Yeah. That's hey, why listen, I don't because so much bullshit. That's a lot of bullshit. V. I get that. Mark got something to say before we move forward. Go ahead, Mark. <laughs> oh, Lord. Turn first that. of all, we talking about 50 50 and Cardi B. When okay. I heard Cardi B talk, mm-hmm. first of all, I can't. I've taught special education for. Oh, Lord. Oh, hey, no, we're not going to do Cardi B. No, like oh, we can't do that. We're going we're gonna, we're gonna get, we're gonna get oh, we're going to do Cardi right. B. Oh, my Cardi God. B knows she sped. Yeah. Like, if don't nobody oh. else know, oh. she was in the class. Yeah, I, I agree. You know what I'm saying? I agree. So it was hard for me. <laughs> To grasp to us and get out and oh. that's just her voice, Mark. That's, that's yeah, she, her voice. She's Puerto Rican or some shit. And she taught to him. She didn't even look like Cardi B no more. She's somebody else. So it, it was face if still. I saw her walk by I with no swear Cardi to God, B. What the, I'm editing this clip. I'm sending this straight to Cardi B. Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah. When I'm saying that, it you know was hard was for me. Right. Even Y'all though she was talking how she was talking about if it if it if it. Cardi B, it, it, it was didn't make sense. Let's no, it didn't make sense. sense. What no. she said, it, it, it didn't make sense. Uh, women are the catch. <laughs> you know not. what I'm saying? If you she want is. that woman, <laughs> you're willing <laughs> to go she above is. and beyond to make sure the woman is happy. Yes, you would like her to contribute. Please, if you want to give me half on this mortgage, good. 
But that's not your job. That's not our job. My job job is to take care of you, Mm -hmm. and you take care of the family. And the kids, and you. But did that come? Where did that come from? What What you mean is is the? I just want to know. Fuck, I know people got questions. Mm -hmm. Where did that rule come from? Did it come from the old school days, or did where did it come from? That was it written to say it's the man's job. To be to the protector and the provider. Oh, it, when yeah, that's what when, I want to uh, know too. When, when uh, yeah, put that finger. Yeah. When 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 Eve came about, when nigga ate the apple. What nah, you? when he took that nigga rib and said that's your help me. Mm. Okay. He gonna help. Gonna help you. See, people yeah. don't understand what help means. Yeah, but nigga not and nigga. Hey, this not been a nigga, biblical episode. Nigga, Eve ain't <laughs> help that nigga go hunt for the cows hey, and the wolves. And the chicken. She cooked it when it came back with it. Yes. Right? That's help. Right. But she I, know, go I didn't need that, though. That's 50 huh? 50. Because that cow didn't cost me. He so I didn't need it. that. I know. Well, but it didn't cost me to kill the motherfucker. You want her to go kill it? What you want? I, that, no, no. I want her to cook it. That's her, that's her help. All right. That's listen. the help that I need, but it didn't cost me anything to go kill it. So, Dima, what you feel you about 50 50? You don't want to spend no money. How do I feel? What's your take on 50 50? No, 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 no. Let me tell you how I feel about 50 50. I agree with Vern 100%. See, people got a misconception of what 50-50. If the bills are 5000 I'm not asking you to bring 2500 to the table. It is my job to make sure we got a roof over our heads. I agree with mm-hmm. that 100%, 1,000%. Now, the way the economy is set up now... Absolutely. I, let, me, let me go back. Let me go back. Let me try to be quick. Uh, I don't know a man in this world, a man, I didn't say... Whoever, bombs and dudes, I don't know a man that don't want their woman to not pay for anything. I have to worry about anything. So right. let's start there. Okay. If I got the whole 5000 I'm good on that. I'm mm-hmm. good with that. But let's talk about reality. Right. It's my job to make sure that the roof is over our heads and I secure and protect this place. Right. Now, babe, I may need you to hit the car note this month. I may need you to get the lights this month. That's the world we live in there right, right now. Right, Correct. Right. That's why we live in there right now. We right. need help. Yeah. And like I said, we, this, need, each not, we <laughs> need each other. Yeah. It's it's so, about it's about what works for your house. It's what works for your like, household. I'm, period. Like, I'm with you on that. Yeah. As far as the man, I'm working two smart, jobs. Smart nigga. So I I know how my household. <laughs> I want my household to run smooth. I would never let baby run, work two jobs. Right. When I'm when I'm eight hours and I come home and have all this free time, I'm gonna get out there and get a, and get something else. And so I'm with you on that. But I don't want but the but the perception of women can't not willing to do 50-50, yeah. I'm glad how V broke it down. Like, no, it ain't about okay, I'm yeah, you might be paying a mortgage, but I'm paying Court knows I'm paying everything else. So when it comes down to it, it's our money, and we breaking it down to where it's being percentage and pie charted out. Because social media is making it like it's just but one Social money. media say no. Right, 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 right. Right. Social media say negative, money. negative money. on, yeah. on, yeah. on I don't have separate money. It's not separate money. I got one money, so I don't that's even it. know what 50-50 it's is. One yeah. money. Everything oh, goes in one it. account. You don't know who it came from. I don't even but see it. You don't know who it came from. I don't even see the money. You know how many married people I know with separate bank accounts? And they think it's okay. That they is think not it's, okay. it's not okay. It's not okay. And let's be very realistic. A lot of women are making a lot of more money than men. Even. No, real talk. I'm yeah. on like, I agree with so that. I would That's never, true. And I, I never like, watch my man struggle and try Especially to pay you in love. That's what I be talking about. I love no. you. I'm going to yeah. do anything. But, but be, and be. I'm going to put you in a better position, dog, baby. How can we? How can I help you make more money when you what make, it is you want to do? <laughs> when you make him more money than your man, on, do you still look at him as head, ho- head of household? It depends on how he acts. If it's he how he still, moving, okay. Yes. Hold on, V. Like Hold on, V. That's another topic? No. Guys, no, just, guys are ready for another you topic? You know how many men are insecure <laughs> if they date a woman and make more money? I don't right, want you to right. be insecure about that because you have to know I got you. Just you know, like that's weird, like, though. You, you know why that's weird that to me? That shit. I'm because they you. pursue a woman, right? Mm-hmm. And, 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 uh, and, and you should know she got a shit First together. off, they know what they do for a living. Right. You know, and then when they had them first intimate conversations, she let you know, nigga, I make more money than you. Right. And uh, he still pursue her. Right. And then they get into a relationship, and, and he get insecure. insecure. He right. insecure, and he tries to does everything to bring her down mentally right. to so make her feel to, like she yeah, ain't really what she thinks she right. is. So he can be ahead, right? Feel like he's more superior than her. Mm-hmm. And so, like, well, that's why I say, if he acting like no, you are always a man, but if you acting insecure because of what I already I'm doing for myself, right? And I'm going to treat him like a little boy. You're going to treat him like a little boy. I'm just going to leave you alone. V, don't get your show yet. Don't get your show yet. Because we're going to get there after yeah. this question right here. Because, uh, you know, we keep it moving. But so what do, what do men do? Because this kind of ties into the topic. Too. So what do you find most common in a relationship? Confusing. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
um the inconsistency. About I've never the man seen so in many so many inconsistent mm. men in my life, and but it's because of social media too. I feel like everybody feel like they have so many options. Yeah. Right. Oh, yeah, she bullshit. pretty, she bad, she got this, she got that. But I probably... Yeah, no bullshit. <laughs> I <laughs> might have a better eight to one. option over yeah. But did I here. lie? Did I lie? Let her finish. Did I lie? She gonna finish. What did you... What What didn't you lie about? Tell him what... Uh, I said it. Demo said he got... Eight he got, I know he got. I didn't say that. I say it's eight to one. Eight to yeah, it's, one, man. It's more women, it's more well, women it's than men. It's more single men. It's more women than men. It is. Yeah. It's, it, it really is, and it's really unfortunate. <laughs> but at the same time, that's why I'm not selling. I'm right. still not selling, but I don't care how many women to men that it is. You're going to choose what you're going to choose, and I'm going to wait on God to send me what's for me. Hello. I'm not pissed to be competing out here for no man. Hmm. No. I ain't pissed to turn yeah, I got to stop you on that, though, like, All this extraness. I'm yeah, not doing that. I gotta slow you down on that. You gotta, you gotta compete though, because like you said, it is eight to one. I'm you, not you in just, competition. You just said this, so you got, you, you gotta be out there like, I'm man. Not, you know what? I'm gonna compete for him. If he's short, if, he, if he's a good, crazy. if he's a good nigga, I'm gonna compete for him. Not, I think you got, you got, you got to, you got to, you got to rise up. You got to show why you the well, rose. If I'm already from a reason. I'm right. not about to do nothing extra just be, to try to Hold on. Just because you a baddie don't mean that you're a you, you, you I'm, I'm mentally, right. intellectual. Okay. You I'm got a homemaker. Just show I'm me that. I'm a nurturer. Show me that. I'm, baby, listen. Okay. Oh, she going to show you, but she okay. ain't competing. Okay. I ain't competing. No, no, you got to compete, man. Well, so I, got two compete sides. I, I got two sides of this, and I could be wrong. <laughs> okay. But V, Vernicia, mm -hmm. you was on Ready to Love a competing episode. Right. So I wasn't you, competing for love, but they, it was more men competing for the women, right? Well, so it it's a competition more... show, and I re I wanted to get into this, so this is perfect timing. Yeah, this, it's is perfect. Timing. this is perfect because, timing. And I'm gonna right. tell you why it's not a competitive show, but this is the thing. Okay, That's this is what we think. Watching, watching, watching. Okay, okay. It's not competition because okay. you are already aligned with your person when you get there. You kind of know, the producers know Put the mic they up, feel like they're going to match we, with. We, we got to use the mic. And that's from my, my first time of <laughs> being on TV. Okay. The dude I connected with, they knew. They said we made perfect sense. Mm -hmm. He was a widow. He had children, entrepreneur, homeowner, blase. Same difference. Mm -hmm. I'm just not a widow. Okay. But a single mom, We it, it made sense. Rather than everybody else on the show who really didn't have children, mm -hmm. were younger than us, um, just like mentally... Not that right. <laughs> there. So they knew we would connect like we mm -hmm. did. And we did. It wasn't a competition. When I felt like he was pursuing or doing something else, I was like, hey, I'm going to go. I can leave you. right." And he like, no. Nah. He always made me feel secure mm -hmm. at, at the moment. But I was a little naive at the time because mm -hmm. I didn't realize, oh, this is really TV. Right. You know what I'm saying? So I always tell people I have a different uh, perspective of like reality TV stars. Y'all don't see... A lot of behind the scenes. Like 30, 40 percent right. of what's really clip. going on. Right. And so uh, that's why we laugh at the company. Like I can't even. I'd be like, y'all have no clue. <laughs> mm -hmm. right. <laughs> so we're not competing. I'm never going on anywhere in any part of my life and competing for a man. If you don't see the material in front of you, baby. So that kind of goes. That kind of goes too back and forth to. <laughs> I don't know what to tell you. Our last episode, where uh, they were saying a woman is who will catch a woman or a man, right? Mm -hmm. Who is the kid? Who is the oh, kid? I've seen his little right, 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 right. Seen his look. So <laughs> I'm glad that kind of going it. back to what you're saying now, and it kind of go back to what Woods is saying to you too. Mm -hmm. You should be competing. I would not. But you feeling like, what am I I'm competing not. for when I'm the kid? What's because for you gonna be for you? You ain't gotta compete for that it. That's crazy. You ain't gotta fight yeah. for it. You ain't gotta cheat for it. You ain't gotta roar for it. What is yours <laughs> is yours, and that's how I feel. I but, think. But, but competing. I'm not doing it. I can explain. Say, I can explain let, let, healthy competition. Healthy competition is 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 is, 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 is being healthy. Looking at your, looking how you look. Being always know when I come outside, I'm gonna I'm gonna look a certain type of way. Being integrity, meaning that you can't you know, can't, can't nobody you talk about what I, what I was doing in the pack. Can't nobody, can't nobody speak on my name back. That's a way of, of, of competing too. Okay. So. I'm gonna break. Hey, boy, I tell you, you a smart ass right. nigga, boy. You have I, switched yeah, I'm not, I'm not gonna just say like, no, you got, no, that, no, B, I'm no. not gonna say you just gotta no. go out there and start we beating not, heads and knocking like heads over. No, we not 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 no, 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 I'm gonna talk. I never, I never show what my level of competition is. You just told her you gotta be able to showcase yourself. I've never heard that for in my life, in my season life. Talk about that a dude tell a woman. You got to go out there and compete for the ball. man. If you want him, you got to compete now. I'm not doing that. You got to rise let above me, let me the fix, eight. 
what he was saying. Okay. Okay? No, it's you, crazy. Don't fix you Hold on, what I'm going to fix it because it was crazy. Like, I ain't never heard, and you was, like, like real Get about it. Get out. Nigga, compete for me. I'm sorry about the chest. But, so this is what happened. We date a bunch of women. We date eight because it's one of us eight. Mm -hmm. So we do talk to our boys and be like, oh, girl, winning right now. Okay. Yeah. But y'all not But compete. we don't know that we're Right, that's what right. I'm saying. So right. that's what yeah. he mean when no, he said. I don't mean that, my boy. No, he mean. You mean, you no, say that. I say what you say. that's what you mean. No, I, I'm not saying. I already broke it down. I don't want. You say what you say. I turn don't it want. In. I don't want to be that nigga, wake up, <laughs> smile, and be like, okay, I got V competing today. Nigga on the reality. Like hey, right. nigga in the reality yeah, show, what I even on. No, ain't nobody saying that. I ain't say well, nothing like that. What you saying? Hey, I love this, because y'all have never went back and I forth. I tried to fix I put the camera on me. <laughs> 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 I'm going to bring, bring, bring it back. I'm, what I'm saying is that you got to have a level of competition. Like, you want to, I healthy competition. I want to be the best for you. I want to showcase my best. When I go outside, I'm not I'm not looking like no bum because I'm in competition with a nigga that's in the turtleneck. Well, let's be clear. <laughs> so I'm in competition with seasoned guys. And let's so I'm be not going to look like no bum. I'm, I'm, I'm getting guys. my shit together. Guys are in competition for Come the women, on, too. So let's be very clear. Just we as well as y'all feel like y'all can date. Hey, I always Multiple say, or not. may the best man win. Right. Always. And so, it, and it's not like, and I hate, like, men <laughs> feel like a woman that are dating multiple men. It's not about sex. Yeah. You don't have to be having sex. And that's what men, too. I would hope that y'all are not sleeping with all eight women at the same time. Uh, uh, maybe six. No. You said Phil gave us a good. Nasty. You remember, Phil <laughs> told you not to. We, we can't be. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We can't yeah. be giving the votes to everybody. Don't give it. Don't give it out no. to everybody. <laughs> so, like, but no. Like, we talk like that, too. We, right. we be like, hey, our boy right. very consistent you, you right now. Finish, huh? He sent no, flowers. You know what I'm saying? Like, <laughs> he is crazy. just, he on his stuff. Right. So, I, I mean, I get it. But. We don't let the man know. Right. Just yeah. like y'all let Let me ask you a question, Demo. What's up, bro? So if you're dating a woman who's dating multiple guys, okay. what do you feel about her? Oh. Uh, I get it. Y'all are not committed. I get it. At, at, at 41? I get it. You. At 41, yeah. I get it. I, it right. She ain't no hoe, none of that. Mm. But I'm not, but I think we got the word, the word in wrong, competition. <laughs> it's not so much competition. It's more like standing out. You know, I'd rather stand out than be compete. I'm not finna compete with now, nigga. Yeah. Cause I know me. Yeah, I'm yeah. Talk to the word competition to me. Hey, for a when that man oh, say you about to compete. Hey, 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 listen, listen. It's, 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 I'm, I'm, it's, it did come yeah, over there from that corner. Standing out than competition. I agree. I don't like competition. Okay. I'm I can, not I in can deal. I can but understand. But I'ma stand out. I'ma have that shit on. And I'm gonna right. smell good, and yeah. I'm gonna pull out in something that, yeah. I can yeah. So I'm, I'm, I'm gonna stand out. I ain't playing with this. Right now, I feel like I feel. I ain't right now. I feel like you, you promoting yourself for whoever watching. <laughs> Do you want to <laughs> drop your Instagram name so they can follow you? <laughs> hey, follow me at uh, Mr. Las Vegas. Uh, follow my cannabis page is uh, mm. Vegas Cannabis, and also follow uh, my betting page at uh, Vegas Sports Betting. Yeah, that's good. But before we we get out of here, man, uh, like I. I wanted to talk about Reddit Love a little bit. What made you go on the show? So, honestly, my best friend, sister, sent it to both of us, right? We were single, whatever. This was three, three years ago? Right. No, you've been on three. about six three. episodes. Yeah, six, six. It was, it was you've been on about six seasons. And so, but no, I actually got picked for the show in 2020, and I was initially picked for the first Houston show. Mm hmm. And so I was in, I had, I was, bags was packed. They told me I was going to Georgia because that was during COVID. And I was going to have to stay there for like a month or over mm -hmm. a month. And like the week before I was supposed to leave, they was like, oh, no, nah, you're going to have to wait. We want you on the next season. Mm -hmm. So, so how that how that made you feel? But hold on, hold on. How that made you feel in that moment? Because right now you ready was, for love. I, yeah. thought it was, I thought it was. <laughs> but they talking like, about now nah, this nigga ain't in this season. No, look, I had to have you gonna have to wait till next party. season, right? <laughs> right. So so do you feel like okay? <laughs> I ain't but do you go back to like I was the like, Bible? Do like what God? Maybe it ain't for me in this season. I'm absolutely okay. Okay, what is it? This was like in the beginning of the year, mid year. And then they was like, we're going to holler at you in December. Mm. So literally, you waiting like six months. Like, you don't know if these people going to call you. Like, what's about to go on? And then November came, and I got contact from them. And then December, and we started family in January. Okay. Okay. Do, do you feel like Ready to Love 
Oh, any need dating show. I didn't, I watch them all. I ain't gonna lie. I'm, I'm on Netflix. I'm on all of them. I was I'm a taking, fan before I was on there. I ain't watched. Oh, uh, you uh, <laughs> you you already said that it's it's real. It's real. It's realistic. Uh, people are really on there. Like I watch uh, what it's I called. Didn't say that. Do you feel like it's real? Because I watch marriage. I don't want to call the whole name out, but marriage, the marriage show, and the people are on there from uh in DC. And they came off ready to love. Love and marriage. Love and marriage. Huntsville. Huntsville. Mm-hmm. Right, but they came off ready to love mm-hmm. and got together. Joy and so is all that re- Do you feel like it's long term coming not, from that so show? I'm, I'm not going to say it's not real. I'm going to say. Uh... No, don't get sued because we really going <laughs> to blow up. 70 no, to 80 percent of the women are there for the right reasons, and 30 okay. to 40 percent of the men. Right. Mm. So mm-hmm. what? Uh, so everybody's not there. You have people that's right. there for their 15 minutes of fame. That's it. Okay. So what happened between you and the guy? Which one? The first guy that you were talking he about. He was you there were for 15 for minutes of fame. Wow. Yeah. So literally, when the camera stopped filming, so I got word after we filmed that he had a he had already had a girlfriend. What? Mm. <laughs> And yeah. I never, I never even like, I never even so, like. So your producers, the, the producers don't. But well, they don't know that. They don't really. They, they don't know. Nah, they can't know that. They, they, they right, can't know that. agenda. When you fill out that application, wow. they send you a Well, no. So you do back. go through a sight test. You right. have to do a credit yeah. check. Yeah. You do a background <laughs> check. Right. You do all of that. Hey, right, Mark know all the rules. I think he signed up before. Hell no! Back in the gap, they sent me an email, nigga. Bro, I'm telling you, they probably did. They like they really sort out their their people. They saw. You out. Yeah. I oh, think that's right. Big word. Yeah. Thank, thank you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, hey, They've seen your social I, media anything, and they would definitely try to. Really? Okay. Yeah. Yeah. And let's, be, let's not get off track. Let's well, not no, get I'm off track. One thing, we, I'm going to be a little messy, man. It seemed like y'all couldn't control Sharice. Like Sharice. Oh, you talking about make a move? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've been Charisse watching. Sharice never played with me. Oh, oh. okay. All right, Sharice. Oh, she? She? Hey, she? Hey, she? I've been watching Sharice, man. Shout All right, Sharice. Hey, Sharice. Sharice, I don't know you, but she on your ass. Sharice, that car come out of eight times. Hey, Sharice. Hey, respect. Hey, shout out to Sharice. Just hey. Hey, I am DJ Reese Boogie. Hey, if you ever come to use a call me. No, that's my girl, though. Oh, yeah. Definitely after she did what she did to Zadia. Yeah. And she'll tell you, I hope she watching. Uh oh. I say, hey, don't ever do that to me. Huh. Off camera. On camera, off camera, <laughs> New Orleans police can't get here fast enough. Ooh. Because my grandmother watch, mm-hmm. my pastor watch, my grown children watch. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Whatever didn't happen on camera shouldn't be spoken on on camera. And right. I feel like she broke the girl code and I explained it to mm-hmm. her. Because we was all cool. Right. And then you making a, a situation seem like it was something more. Than, it wasn't that. Yeah. So like I say, y'all only see a like glimpse a of things. But I'm very respectful. Right. I'm a girl's girl. Mm-hmm. But hey. That's cool. So. It okay, is. I got I got to run through this a little bit, but do they uh do they kind of give y'all the scenes before y'all get to the scene or y'all? Well, they, it, no, you just show up. So they tell you you have you have call every day where you're gonna be, what time? Like that's like the dudes, the last dude, mm-hmm. uh, the Tabari dude. Yeah. The dudes don't plan dates. They right. don't spend money on dates. There's nothing like that. Right. It's right. productions work to tell us we are going to work. Now I see okay. why you signed up. No, Where are we going to? <laughs> and we don't know who's going to be there half the time until right. you get there. Wow. You really okay. don't know. Okay. So my thing and my problem mm. with him was, you ain't putting no effort behind this camera. I don't mm. really know what type of... Mm. We hardly even talked on the phone. Like, mm-hmm. it was nothing. But do y'all have access to the you phones? You have access, and I, yes. And he not texting or talking to him like that? Barely. So that, wow. the first dude was, <laughs> yes. the very first So you dude, should know. Worry. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. well, you watch, but Tabori was yeah. not. But Tabori went on a whole crybaby spree. Whole bunch of he went crying all over the internet. So you should know. You should know before because you even get there. Him. You should know before you get there, though, right? That they really bullshit, or they might be there for well, another reason. So you, you're hoping. The show is ready to love. You're hoping. Right. You're, hoping that, right. you're hoping that somebody you're that's hoping solid. That somebody that's solid. Yeah. All right. You know, but right. you don't know. But in my head, I didn't have any expectations, honestly. Okay. I was because after the first show, I was okay. like, "Yeah, all these niggas." Was New Orleans better or was uh, season three better? Uh, what was season three shot? Houston. It was in Houston. And but like, what I like. Why well, ain't bring them to the spot? You know, we fuck with the spot. I used to bring them uh, in now, my girls. No, I'm well, talking I, about well, the we, production. I done seen y'all. Yeah, I done seen y'all. <laughs> seen y'all. <laughs> seen I know you. I know you. You bachelor of the year. You try to get on the show. The difference is with Houston, we was able to film and go home. Right, that's New that. Orleans. I had to build that for almost two months mm. away from my. I had never been away from my house that long ever. Uh, so it was different, but I enjoyed it. 
I enjoy my vacation, like yes. literally. And I enjoy the girls, like we had a good time. Mm -hmm. Like we literally, and you, you're just able to relax and you have people like catering to you all day, mm -hmm. chauffeuring not, you around, dope. cooking mm -hmm. for you, yeah. Yeah. you getting paid. It's like- Why you down to a lot of women be bullshit women? You be, I was you only there with four women this time. Oh, so okay. out of 200 castmates, we got the first. That's dope. That was that dope. dope. How that feel knowing out of wow. 200 that you got the four? Like, but you know what? That mean like the you re you really ready say, for love no, or what they, they feel just like? Say we made an impact. Like mm -hmm. Vernicia, we always talk. That's about That's the New Orleans episode you talking about, right? Mm -hmm. The New Orleans yeah, season. That's how I got back on there. They always say like we you made an impact. Like people right. love you. You know what I'm saying? Do you, you feel like you got? Is there any chance that you may have your own little show? Well, I, do. Yeah. I have something coming up. What's coming up? up? What's coming Shit. up? Baby? So I can't yeah. talk about it. Oh, no, okay, no, she okay, can't no, talk no. about it. She can't yeah. talk about it. Hey, man, we thought shot o'clock. Hey, we got the exclusive. We thought shot o'clock had that shit. Man, hold on. They want me on like a seasonal show. Yeah, to where it's not just like a real time. Oh, Phil. All right, but look, though. Look, though, V. I, I, but not a dating show. I'm not doing any more dating shows. No more I'm about to say, I'm about to say, cuz. Okay. That is it. Like, uh, I am done with that. Uh, I gotta, we gotta get out of here, V. <laughs> we, got, we gotta get out of here. So my last, I got probably got like two more, cuz I keep thinking of them as I talk. Are you still looking for love? So I'm not looking for love. Uh oh. Mm -hmm. But I'm open to love. Okay. So just because okay. I was on a show, like, ready to love, I'm never, like, looking for anybody right. to love. I'm very loved, let's yeah. be very clear. Mm -hmm. So I'm open to be loved by a man properly and I right want on. my kids to see me in a very healthy relationship. Right on. I haven't lived with a man in over 10 years. Okay. And so I've raised my girls pretty much by myself after uh, my last relationship and that's it. Mm -hmm. Okay. So yeah, I mean, it's right gonna on. take a, you know, special kind. Eggplant. Uh -huh. I don't care, <laughs> <man>. <laughs> <What>? <laughs> hey, hey, and just like yeah, that, yeah. we appreciate V. Appreciate you, v. Vernicia coming out on the Shot O'Clock podcast, man. Y'all make sure y'all look at season two, or season three, season four. The way no, just no, no, no. She got something coming. No, up. she got she got I ready know. to love. Hey, fella, y'all made me look. I don't know what the fuck I'm talking about. <laughs> make sure y'all look at Ready to Love New Orleans and, ready and to check love out Houston and Ready to Love you. Houston. And check out, man. We appreciate everybody. What else you got to do? Give her social media. Oh, yeah. Go ahead. Oh, my social media is uh, Vern underscore spoiled. And my Instagram. Oh, that's the same. Yeah. Instagram and Facebook. Vernicia Allen on Facebook. Um, I'm on Twitter. Vernicia Allen. I think that's it. Yeah. Give your businesses, too. One oh, more time. Uh, so, Sport Run Beauty Bar. It's our financial agency. Uh. Yeah, that's it right now. I'm really kind of upset, but we got to go because yeah. social media is Vern. Underscore. underscore. Vern. You know what I'm saying? Well, my business is spoiled But she right told me, no, nah, nah, you told brand. me don't call you Vern. Don't. <laughs> <laughs> hey, 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 Judge, just like yeah. that, man. Shack Life Park, and we out of here. Yes, Look. <laughs>